So many of you know, you have the LS water pump, obviously. What you'll see is right here, this is the um, outlet. This is an out. So to heat the occupants first, it circulates through the engine before it circulates through the radiator. And so those of you that know, when you remove your expansion tank, you have to loop these two, otherwise uh, the thermostat won't open. And sometimes they do, uh, but eight out of 10 times they don't open. So uh, because the thermostat is dual stage, right? You have this one, this opening in here, further down in there on that valve, and then you have this one here. So it shuttles between these two uh, for occupancy comfort. What I do is I completely remove the thermostat housing and everything. So that way you have inlet, and this is blocked, which is part of this passage here, and goes to the outlet, right? Well, that's not always feasible for, uh, you know, someone doing work in their garage and have access to a welder, they don't want to pay for it, whatever. So when you remove the thermostat, uh, remove the thermostat housing, remove the thermostat, when you pull the thermostat housing back on, you end up with a scenario where the water uh, simply circulates in the engine and it doesn't flow out of here. Well, when you plug this, when you plug that dude, it's essentially doing the same thing that I do here. So it's a quick and dirty way to achieve what you're after uh, without having to fabricate.